Hey y'all, so anybody who didn't watch my other channel and my Get Ready With Me, I guess wouldn't know this, but my grandma officially passed away <sighs> right after I made that video yesterday talking about how I'm grieving her and how I don't know how I'll handle it when she actually passes away. So basically she passed away an hour after I made that video. It's been a horrible 24 hours for me because me being somebody who is an alcoholic, basically, all I want to do is drink. The only thing that stopped me yesterday from drinking over this was the fact that my mom wouldn't let me go to the grocery store alone. And she had to go with me. She had to go inside the grocery store. Because if she didn't force herself on going with me and us getting in a damn argument over that, I would have drank, to be quite honest. And I know that would have not made me feel happy in the morning and then in the end of all this so I'm glad that I didn't do that but it's just so hard to see your parents crying you know your loved ones all upset and knowing that you can't do anything to fix that you know I can't bring my grandmother back and this was my last you know living grandmother so I don't have any grandparents anymore and I, I don't know how to handle that I, I don't I'm I've been trying to distract myself by online shopping I haven't found anything that I want to fucking buy other than a new wig um I'm just I, I feel so sad that I don't know what to do with myself other than trying to distract myself even though I know that's stupid but that's just how I deal with things and I know it's unhealthy and I don't know what else to fucking do y'all and I know it's not just me hurting, it's my whole family hurting. I'm not trying to be selfish. I'm just saying, y'all, being in this fucking state of de of depression and feeling lost, feeling like, you know, will I ever see my grandmother again? Will I ever make it to heaven my damn self to see my grandma again? My grandmother was such a loving woman. Every time I would freak out, say if we were on a road trip, me and my parents were on a road trip, and I, you know, I have anxiety when it comes to interstates and traffic and stuff. I would call her and she would calm me down because she has anxiety problems. She knows what it's like to have a panic attack. So me and her were a lot alike. You know, um, she took Xanax for her anxiety. She would always joke around and tell me that if I take a Xanax a day, I'll be fine. Um, she was just a hoot. She was very caring, very loving, always complimenting me, making me feel beautiful every time I saw her. And now it's like, I don't have that support. I mean, sure, I'm on parents still. But I don't have that second motherly support that I got from her as well. And it's sad because, you know, I've lived, you know, I've, I've known her all these years. I'm 25. So I've known her all my fucking life. And she's loved me all my life like my mom does. <sighs> Y'all, I don't know how to get over this shit. I don't know how to feel better. I even wanted to order a pizza, but I'm like, what's the fucking a point of ordering goddamn pizza if I'm not going to want to eat it any goddamn way? What am I going to do? Look at the damn pizza? Like, I don't want to eat you guys. I don't want to shop. Nothing is enjoyable to me. <laughs> I'm only able to make this video because I know that if I say it to you guys, it'll make me feel somewhat better. And maybe you guys are wondering if she passed, but yes, she did. She passed yesterday afternoon. Um, my auntie was in the bed with her you know, cuddling with her and she just, you know, my auntie just told my grandmother, it's okay. You can go on and be with your parents, mom. You can go be with your, um, your, your brothers and sisters up in heaven. And she went on and yeah, and she died right next to my auntie. So, so yeah, I, I don't know what to do with my emotions, my feelings. I'm all fucked up, but just pray for me, y'all. I don't know when I'm going to really make any good videos I don't know if I'm going to actually feel better or feel good enough to even talk shit or joke around about other YouTubers right now. I just don't know. All right, bye.